Well, good morning, YouTube. Um, it's now Wednesday. Um, I did say I would do this over the weekend for somebody who's asked for it on my channel. Um, but unfortunately, I've been a little bit busy. And what it is, um, it's in Final Cut Pro, and it's the Bruce X test for 5K. Um, apparently, it's a benchmarking thing. I've never used it. I've just read how to do it. Um, so we'll go through it. Um, so the stipulations are it's a final cut um, final cut um, XML file you need to open um, QuickTime player as it opens the file in there and also you need to have turned off in your preferences um, background render so obviously once it's loaded it can't um, also put the background tasks on the teller here and I will let it run throughout but obviously I need to record it on my phone as a stopwatch and um, you'll just have to believe me that what's on my stopwatch is accurate um, I've got no affiliation to anything for this um, I don't even know how long it'll take it's the first time I've run it I've just read about it um, so let's see how it goes um, so the files on my desktop and according to the instructions it's file import XML Desktop is there. Bruce test import. Obviously with background render on, it's not actually doing anything. I do have the background tasks open, so you can see the the computer's not actually doing anything. Um, and just check QuickTime still open, which it isn't. So I'll have a. Um, so it's open keeps closing for some reason um, let's see why I don't know let's see if there's anything in its preferences why it's closing not sure open there switch to that and it closes. Um, just going to pause the video and see if I can uh, find out why that's happening. Apparently, it's to do with um, some app termina termination that Apple um, do. Um, apparently, it opens, um, it shows there, but when you move it, um, it then goes into the background somewhere, uh, but it's still open. I'm not sure if that'll have an effect on how quick it starts up, but it shouldn't. It would only matter one or two seconds. Um, so I'm going to select the Bruce X test, go to share master file, um, and in the settings, um, ProRes, QuickTime Player, Open QuickTime Movie um, is apparently the standard. Um, go to next. Go to save, and then we'll start the stopwatch. As you can see, it has in the background tasks, it's firing up, um, all working well. Um, and we'll see how long it takes. I'll let it run for the full time and see how it does. If anybody else wants any other videos uh, to be done, I'm quite happy to do them. Um, I can't do videos like, can you compare this laptop and that laptop, because unfortunately, I don't have a channel like that and people like HP just won't send a random person like myself um, one of their new laptops. If they did, I'd be more than happy to do any comparisons between um, Final Cut Pro, uh, Adobe Premiere Pro, etc, etc, Photoshop, anything like that. Um, I do pay for all of the software myself. Um, none of it's been gifted uh, by Apple or Adobe. Um, it's just I have an interest in it and this is what I like doing. Um, so as you can see we're up to 71% now. I don't know how the effective screen recorder in the background has on it. Um, we're just over a minute in um, and now up to a minute and 10 seconds. It seems to be doing well. Um, so I'll try and see the stopwatch at 100%. So that's 100 done and that's 1 minute and 18 seconds um, it took on the stopwatch uh, before it showed in QuickTime Player. Um, don't know if that's good. 
um, do know if it's bad uh, please comment below um, positive or negative and I'll see you guys later